Welcome back, everyone. Andy Johnson's with us today from Westgate Entertainment Center. We're talking a little bit about uh, for today's uh, business spotlight about your business and kind of how you evolved. First of all, if you could kind of give me a sense, go back in time if you could, and tell me how you got started and how everything came about. Yeah, uh, thanks, Jeff. We're uh, third generation uh, business owner here in Lima. Uh, our grandfather started in 1958 with uh, bowling and a small little what we called coffee shop at the time. And uh, we've really evolved quite a bit over the years. Uh, my father ran it for about 20 years, and my brother and I got in about 30 years ago. And um, we've really uh, changed quite a bit from not just bowling anymore to lots of uh, new attractions and expanded our restaurant operations over the years quite a bit. Yeah, it, and I'm glad you mentioned that because I think you go back to 1958 and your grandpa. What would you? What do you think he'd? he'd say if he saw how you guys have expanded today everything it's just a huge operation now and you're involved in so many different things what do you think he'd say i think he'd be real happy for us him and my father uh, they were always looking for the newest thing my grandfather actually started in a hotel business and uh bowling was really thriving at the time we got into business so i think he'd be real happy with us excited for us yeah you know and, and it's one of those businesses like you say where you had to evolve there, there's been a lot in your business and a lot of other businesses that haven't made it over the years you guys have and you've thrived and i think a big part of that is because you constantly evolve and change it was that kind of a conscious decision that like okay we have to meet whatever the public wants and and what their needs are sure i think uh my brother and i realized early on that if we wanted to stay in this business the long term or any business we really needed to try and be uh, evolving as we went uh, figure out what the new trends are, talk to other uh, owners and facilities in our business, uh, in our area of business. And, um, and over the years, we've added um, an expanded arcade. We uh, just added bumper cars, of course, about a, a year ago, along with some virtual reality. And our latest thing was uh, axe throwing. We opened about a month ago, and then uh, it's doing really well also. So we're real excited about everything we've been doing here. Yeah, I love the the axe run. I'm not sure you would want me in there or anybody that works here, but how how's that? That's gone pretty good so far, then, right? Yeah, yeah. Like I said, we just opened about a month ago. Uh, it's gradually picking up every weekend, and uh, once we hit fall here, we think it's going to do really well. We're real excited about it, and uh, it's kind of something everybody can do. They just uh, 12 and up can actually do it. Uh, it's a good date night, good for bring your uh, business, your employees out, a uh, group of friends. Uh, should be a good time for everybody. Is there anything that you've got uh, blueprint wise on the drawing board that you're thinking, okay, this might be the next wave of entertainment for us? Sure. So um, we, we've got some stuff that we're thinking about and been thinking about for a couple years and um, maybe a year or so down the road, you might see something new again here at Westgate. Yeah. The, what, the virtual reality, that's, uh, that's kind of sweeping the nation. How did that come about? And what, what do you guys have in that area? Yeah. So we, uh, we go to a really big trade show in Orlando every fall and, um, we came across that actually a few years ago at the trade show. My brother and I, Wes and I, we, uh, we came across this at the trade show floor and um, it was about an hour wait to play it. And we finally got on and played it. And we're like, oh my gosh, we need to have one of these. <laughs> and uh, so we kind of searched around, shopped around a little bit, finally found one and everybody seems to really love it. Yeah, and food-wise, you guys have some of the best pizza I've ever tasted, and you, and you kind of accommodate to all different hours if, if folks are hungry and want to come on in, right? Yeah, so like I said, we have great pizza, we serve breakfast all day, have a full uh, menu of sandwiches and appetizers, and uh, always add new stuff on the menu too. And so come on out, check us out. You guys are busy, always evolving. Andy, thanks so much, we appreciate it. Well, thanks for having me today. You bet, nice chatting with you. We'll be back after this.